I'm so excited by the doors of opportunity that the Lord is opening to us this year. Right now, we are targeting the Ivory Coast in West Africa for an April mission, a gospel mission to bring healing and, and reconciliation in a country that's been in civil war since 2002. If you've been following the news, you know that the bloodshed has been extreme. Even in the capital city of Abidjan alone, more than one million people have been displaced. The such brutality in this civil war, villages where the soldiers just come in and just kill people, just, just kill them like they would kill cattle. It's just cruel. It's, it's a country that's shuddering from the effects of, of this, this cruel civil war. And we've been asked to come. The pastors have said, come, come now, because we believe that the gospel through you will bring healing to our nation. So while I don't usually go to capital cities, I have felt strongly to go to the capital city of Ivory Coast so that I can be right there where the seat of government is, where the decisions are being made. I'm expecting to see the, the people in power, in government, maybe the head of state. I am believing for God to use us on this mission to make a difference. We don't just go as ordinary preachers to preach, pray for the sick, pack our bags and come home. Oh no, we are going on a strategic mission to bring healing and forgiveness and love and, 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 and resolve in this very, very difficult situation. Of course, in the midst of that, Jesus is going to be preached. People are going to receive him, receive him by the hundreds of thousands. I believe that. And they're going to see miracles of healing. There will be notable miracles that take place because Jesus is targeting Ivory Coast through us. Now, I've done some calculations and we need to raise $52,000 before April. Can you imagine touching and healing an entire nation for $52,000? If you, you, we hear our governments talk about billions of dollars and trillions of dollars and multiplied billions and trillions, but in the work of Christ, He's the valuable resource. And it just takes a little bit of money to allow His greatness, His riches to be spread across a nation. $52,000, we can reach the, the nation of Ivory, of Ivory Coast with the love and miracle healing of Christ. That is when I've, I figure the people that we will reach and the amount of money that we need to raise, we can reach one person for 13 cents. Less than a cup of coffee. Less than five cups of coffee. <laughs> we can reach one people with one person with the message of Christ. That's $13 for a hundred people. Where can you invest $13 for a greater dividend in the kingdom of God. As a Christian, of course, you're like us. You make every financial decision with Christ in mind. $1,300 would bring Christ to 10,000 people. Can you imagine $52,000? Well, it's possible that one person could write a check for that amount of money and know that they themselves have reached a nation for their contribution. But we're not leaving out the person that can only give $13 or 13 cents. My friend, go with us through a very special sacrificial gift to Ivory Coast. And let's bring Jesus to this nation. Let's show the world that when a nation is in trouble, governments may not always step in. Politicians may not always have the answer. The economic systems of our world may not know how to bring solution, but Jesus is the answer in every situation. And we are his carriers. We carry him to these places and his presence makes the difference. So do your part, do it quickly. Begin now praying and thinking, what can I do, Lord, to make a difference in Ivory Coast? We're counting on you, and the Lord is counting on you. So act quickly, act decisively, and come with faith before the Lord with your gift, and let's see what God will do. Hallelujah. God bless you for your heart for others.